Hi, my name is Miguel from avoiderrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install DHCP roll on Windows 2008 server. So let's begin. Click on Start. And then click on Server Manager. Then click on Roles. And now click on Add Roles. Now make sure that you have a uh, strong password and a static IP address. You don't need the uh, latest security update. And then click Next. In the uh, server role, check mark DHCP server. In case you don't know what DHCP server is, you can read here. And click Next. Here, make sure that you have planned your subnet scope and exclusions before you click on Next. I only have uh, one network connection here, so I'm going to select that to uh, give out IP addresses. Some people have two or three, and you can select a different one to assign IP addresses to your clients. Once you have selected the network connection, click on Next. Here is your DNS settings. You can click on Validate to make sure everything is OK. If you have an, al an alternate DNS settings, you can type it here and click on Validate to make sure the alternate DNS settings is OK. Now click on Next. Here, I'm not using uh, Wings server but if you are just check mark that you are using Wings server and then type the IP address of the Wings server and alternate if you have an alternate Wings server now click on next and here now uh, click on add to add the DHCP scope name your scope I'm gonna name this my first scope the starting IP address I'm going to select 192.168.1.115. Perfect. And my ending IP address would be 192.168.1.253 because 255 is for broadcast and 254 is for routers. So my ending uh, IP address range will be 253. Now, subnet mask is going to be. 255.255.255.0 my default gateway would be 192.168.1.1 but since it's optional I'm gonna leave it blank now subnet type select wired or wireless I selected wired make sure activate this scope is checked and click OK perfect now click on next This here is for IP version 6 clients. I haven't configured this yet, so I'm going to select Disable DHCP version 6 and then click on Next. Here is for the authorization of this uh, DHCP server. You can use the uh, current credentials, an alternate username, or skip the authorization of this DHCP. I'm going to leave it default and click on Next. Now here, confirm the installation and click install. DHCP server installation succeeded. Perfect. Now click on close. Here click on DHCP server under role summary and you can manage your IP addresses. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, please feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.